kinfolk, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a recipe for you. This is a perfect day for a pot roast and I wanted to share it with you guys. If you want a super easy crock pot pot roast recipe, then keep watching. For this recipe, you're going to need, of course, a pot roast, whatever size you want. This one is almost three pounds and it's an Angus roast. You're going to need one onion, I prefer sweet onions, some red potatoes, pretty much however much you want. You're gonna need some Merlot, I got the cheapest one I could find. I think this was like $4. Then you're gonna need one package of beef stew, one packet of ranch salad dressing seasoning mix, and then one packet of Italian salad dressing seasoning mix. And that's it. If you wanna put some vegetables, you can put some carrots, some celery, whatever you want in there, but this is what I like. Meat and potatoes, that's it. So to begin, I'm going to cut up my potatoes and my onion. After you cut up your potatoes, you wanna go ahead and put them in a bowl and set them off to the side. Now you wanna take your pot roast, and I'm gonna cut off this thick layer of fat because while it may add flavor, I don't like the fat. Now that all that nasty fat is cut off, I'm gonna take some Himalayan pink salt, paprika, and some black pepper, and I'm gonna season my meat really well. And the time has come to crack open that Merlot. The Merlot that I went with was, like I said, it was like a really cheap $4 bottle of wine. It's a Beringer, Beringer or Beringer wine, and it's just a simple Merlot. So you wanna go ahead and crack that open and pour it over the onions that are already already in the crock pot. Just to coat them, you don't have to put a ton. Now that the wine is in there, go ahead and take your roast and lay the roast on top of the onions. After you put the roast, then you can go ahead and add your potatoes and your vegetables if you choose to put vegetables in it. It's time to mix all of the seasoning packets. So I have some water boiling behind me and I'm going to put all three of these packets, the beef stew, the ranch, and the Italian seasoning all in a bowl and blend them together. I'm gonna take some hot water. The water doesn't necessarily have to be hot. I do want all of the seasoning to be completely blended and really smooth before I pour it into the crock pot. So I'm gonna start with one cup of hot water and I'm going to whisk the ingredients together. Then you just wanna go ahead and pour this on top of the roast in the crock pot. All the ingredients are now in the crock pot and the crock pot is ready to go. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on. I'm gonna set it for high. I want it to be done in about maybe five hours. So I set the timer for five hours on high and now we wait. So the pot roast is ready and now I'm gonna plate my dish. This pot roast has been cooking for about five hours now. So it looks and smells delicious. So I went ahead and made some mashed cauliflower, which you guys will see in the next recipe video, so stay tuned because they're delicious. And I'm gonna plate my dish. The moment of truth. Oh yeah. That's good. I love this recipe. I actually got this recipe on allrecipes.com and I made some minor adjustments. It is so good. So, if you decide to try it yourself, don't forget to take a picture of it on Instagram, hashtag Shauna Marie B, and tag me at smarie1127 and let me know how you like it. But thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up because it really helps my channel. Comment, share, subscribe, and help me to continue growing my family. Bon appetit.